perched at the foot of the Abadeas Ranges in Nyandarwa County is Lake Olbolosat. The lake's blue waters nourishes the farmlands in the rich agricultural county. It also replenishes water in River Ewasonyiro, a source of livelihoods for communities in neighboring Samburu County in which the river traverses with its cargo of water. The lake is known to be a habitat for hippos and hundreds of bird species and was quote-unquote discovered way back in 1883 by a Scottish explorer, Joseph Thompson. Sadly, it is on its deathbed. Environmentalists are worried because if it dries up, several features will be affected, including the picturesque Nyahururu Thompson Falls, a major tourist attraction. The lake has so far lost its water surface area from about 10,000 hectares to just under 3,000 hectares. And before it is gasseted, we need to re-establish uh, the beacons, the boundaries of the lake, so that we can know where the original uh, boundaries of the lake are uh, using our development plan that was there uh, years back. All is not lost as the government has chosen Lake Olbolosat, the only lake in Mount Kenya region, as the location for the commemoration of this year's World Wetlands Day on February the 2nd. Judith Akolo, Channel One News.